welcome back to abra knowledge channel today we are going to take the test together on mini tab and in the simply learn that offers you to check the mini tab understanding and we are going to do it uh, with the help of simply learn free mini tab exam preparation practice test right and i will keep this link in the description so that you can have a follow and and then i'm just scrolling down basically it gives instructions and uh, free test can be attempted multiple times 40 minutes and there are 26 questions and you can pass the test in between you are allowed to retest the later also as well so i'm going to go in the credentials i'm going to give it and i'm going to tell that the reason the self learning knowledge validation i'm going to give start one the first question when conducting a grr study it is important to take the random one although all the questions all the options are close uh, close to the answer but uh, this seems like randomization is important for gauge repeatability and reproducibility let's go to the next question which of the following tabs provide a test of equal variance test of equal variance so you have a the variance when you do that we we wanted to know the variance everything anova analysis of variance is the best tool and let's go to the third question if the correlation coefficient are equal to minus 0.87 what can be said about the linear correlation between x and y so if it is minus we know it is a negative right and 0.7 and above it is strong correlation so it is weak strong why it's saying strong because greater than 0.7 and negative correlation so this should be the answer difference between observed uh, value average of measurement and the reference value is known as repeatability so for example let's say this is your observed value and this is your reference value let's say we we put it both together there is small subtle difference right this difference that is called repeatability and let's go to fifth question from the below option identify what is the significant difference of two average right so two sample average are numerically different because we are talking about variable data of course uh, it's we are talking about numerical expression in regression analysis if the value of r square equal to 0.90 what does it mean it means that 0.9 is 90% of the total variation is explainable by the regression equation under which menu you can find box cox transformation you will find under stat menu let's see that i'm going to mini tab and you will find stat and in the control chart you will find box cox so the answer is stat the condo plots is a graph that can be used to explore the potential relationship between let's see that what mini tab has given about this go to graph and you will find condo plots and says examine the relation between a response variable that is z and two predictor variables x and y so that means the three three variables regression techniques used to analyze the relation between x and y under which menu you find bar chart you find under graph menu let's see bar chart you will find under graph menu under graph menu. and let's go to the next one null hypothesis always deals with equity equality of uh, different processes it always treats as equal in many tab if you get the p value less than 0.05 that means we are going to reject the null hypothesis while carrying out the anova what we conclude that is the population mean in a different level of the factor are different with the five percentage risk because if you are giving like alpha is 95 percentage that mean five percentage risk if you are giving the alpha is 99 one percentage risk the black belt feels that the defect depend depend on the operator skills and shift in a day Con consequently he collects the both the data three shift and three operators right 
and from the following one so we can't do z test f test and t test because those are variable and and now it has been done in different times so correlation and regression you can do scatter regression fitted line and all that you can do under which menu you find quality tools quality tools you will find under stat menu you find here quality tools under stat menu From the following option, identify the objective of using Pareto diagram. Separating the vital few or the travel many. We'll get a clarity. Variation in the, uh, the average measurement made by different appraisers by the same gauge is measurement is called reproducibility, right? Since it's appraiser, it's a reproducibility. Under which menu you find the scatter plot, you'll find in the graph menu, very first option. Under the graph menu, very first option is scatter plot. A team leader wants to establish the relationship between the email processing time and five categories, right? Five email category from the following option. Identify the test to be concluded. You can do the best test you can do is ANOVA analysis of variance because the category, let's say, email responded yet to respond open unread email a lot of categories so you can put like ANOVA chi square for discrete and uh, f test and t test is basically uh, you can do it only one sample or two sample but here you have five categories so ANOVA is the best in many tab what does the session window it gives a graphical output right for example let's say so I have this data one two three four five and I wanted to find out the basically a stat one for example display descriptive statistic I wanted to find out and let's say I will keep that uh, box plot as an option so you can give here so you you find here like all these one this is called session folder so basically it gives the graphical representation And when using a non-normal data, what type of hypothesis tests uh, test would one choose, right? Select all that apply. So one sample is for parametric, and this could not be an answer. Mode median, this could be an answer. Criscal also, this could be an answer. Under which menu you find sort, you find under data. I'll find, I'll show you how. Under data, I'm going to, Minimize this one under data. You have all this option sort ranking copy and all that After finding and selecting the solution what we should do is you should find out the risk cost benefit implementation plan all the above Under which menu you find paired details you find under stat menu right for example, go to stat, go to basic statistic, you have paid test. Basically, it come from stat menu. From the following, identify the options which enables you to predict the output value when a definite combination of two input. So we know that say uh, condo plot, right? We, we already saw that in the condo plot you see here. I'll keep the cursor here and it, it is to predict one variable that is z with the help of two predictors and under which menu you find measurement system analysis you find under assistant menu this is a tricky question and as a whole topic measurement system analysis you find under assistant if you wanted to find out individual topic like under msa you have two topic right uh, for example, let's say you wanted to find out gauge study gauge RNR you find here or accept I mean attribute agreement analysis you find here So it is individual topic you find under stat, but whole topic you will find under system menu. The last question here we go under which menu you find individual plot one is graph menu you find here in the graph menu you have individual plots right individual value plots so that's it we have completed the test in just 10 minutes uh, let's see the score yeah so 26 out of 26 
and 100% mark we have got and also we can get the explanations everything so all our answers are absolutely correct it also gives that basic explanation for each thing and i will also you can i will also will give this link you can also try to take this uh, one and it will be a lot of fun as such please do like share subscribe my channel you have wonderful day ahead